you have 10 to 12 new names coming at you every 15 minutes. So it is an extreme exercise of memory. And yet, uh, you know, there is uh, such a familiarity from being here every night, seeing the draws four days in advance, and then seeing the horses uh, from the time the program comes out to post parade to the pregame talks with our television commentators. And uh, so it's just a case of uh, familiarity, concentration, uh, short-term memory training, and the love of the game. Brittany Farms and AFJ Stables owner Mike Safford Drive 7, Equinox Hanover, a primary function of the job, along with uh, the professional accurate commentary as the race is in progress, is uh, the reliable relay of all of the other racing information. Thanks, Judge. I am not involved at all in the decision. I just announce what the judges decide. From the inquiry, it's determined there will be no racing rules violations. 1993 Cadillac Breeders' Crown. The night of the 1993 Breeders' Crown at Mohawk, when a uh, lifetime dream with this obscure uh, rural Ontario homebred stepped up and beat the best of the world and won the Breeders' Crown. And what people don't know about that is that uh, we too become very emotionally involved in the races. And within a few minutes of that, there was this blockbuster stretch drive the very same night one of the greatest stretch drives of the Breeders' Crown Series in history, involving two great mares, Swingback and Shady Daisy. And that was, you know, within just a very few minutes of tears coming to my eyes when Lifetime Dream had won the Breeders' Crown. So I had to recollect myself and get ready to do it again very, you know, 15 minutes later. Lifetime Dream is going to fulfill the Lifetime Dream! Lifetime... Just tell the story and not try to be the story. There are other announcers who are a lot more flamboyant, uh, but at the end of the day, after accuracy, um, after accuracy, it's just all window dressing. The head's just leader, Gunner's Bow. I'm very, very fortunate at age 46 that heading into my last eight and a half years, my love of the game continues to grow. That's it, folks.